Nico Brown is with the Howard Head Sports Medicine Center, and when I think of Howard Head, what I think of, and I've been through it myself after some injuries, is physical therapy after I've had a problem. This uh, conference is about injury prevention. How does that work for you? A absolutely. Uh, physical therapy classically is a reactionary uh, mechanism. We're looking to transform what we do in a number of different ways. One way we do that is with large employers, with our Safe Fit Musculoskeletal Wellness Program, where we've decreased the barriers of entry so people can get the care they need before it becomes a more chronic or expensive uh, concern for the employers. Another way that we really focus on prevention is working with the U.S. ski team as well as the U.S. climbing team to really say, okay, what sort of injury uh, trends are we seeing? How do we put that into a, a practice where we can uh, take care of these proactively instead of being so reactionary in medicine. Let's talk about what is often a specific problem for ski racing and, and general skiing, and that's knee injuries. So what might you do or tell me to do to prepare myself better to potentially avoid that besides having my bindings adjusted right and skiing sensibly? Certainly. I mean, the first thing that I highly recommend is an annual musculoskeletal exam. So you can see how you're doing year after year. Is your flexibility improving or is it not? Is your muscle strength improving or is it not? Do we have different asymmetries that are affecting our performance? And then with that information, you can take and individualize a prevention program that will really not only improve performance, but decrease and mitigate your risk of injury. How does this all tie in with the Stedman Philippon Research Institute and the Stedman Clinic? We think of the Stedman Clinic, that's where you go after you've had the injury. Well, I think it it's really aligns with the mission of Spry, the Stedman Clinic, the Vail Valley Medical Center, and Howard Head. And this collaboration is really looking to not only take care of people, but transform the way in which we deliver medicine. Is this going to be more and more common? Are other physical therapy centers going to be looking at things this way, or is this just a brand new idea? You know, I, th I do believe that there's a trend in the market, but, you know, we like to be the tip of the arrow, and we got to see what happens in the future. Nico Brown, thank you very much, and definitely the tip of the arrow.